What else got people? Today I've got these good fella pizza pockets. These sound absolutely gorgeous. £1.50 from Sainsbury's and they're microwavable. So they're going to be quick. We're going to see if they are any good. So let's take a look at the packet. Come down. Don't be shy in what there wasn't. They look nice on there, don't they? I won't be having any of this rabbit food with it. I'll just be having them on their own. Made with respect. Good fellas. Pizza pockets, triple cheese, perfect for a light meal. Here at Goodfellas, we are passionate about pizza, blah, blah, blah. Okay, we get it. You like pizza. They are from Bird's Eye as well. I didn't know Bird's Eye made them. They normally make fish fingers and peas. Cooking instructions, you can cook them in the microwave, which is what I'm going to do. Now it says one pizza pocket, two and a half minutes. Now I'm going to cook two. So does that mean I've got to put them in for five minutes? I'm not too sure about that. Or you can cook them in the oven. Who's going to cook them in the oven when you can have them in two minutes in the microwave? Ingredients, pizza sandwich, tomato sauce, mozzarella cheese, Edam cheese and Emmental cheese. I'm not even sure what that is. Allergens, milk, wheat. And it says may contain egg, mustard and soya. So you've got cheese in there, milk, tomato puree, black pepper for a bit of seasoning and stuff like that. Pause it here to see on how unhealthy they are, if you dare. Let's get them open. So there we go, there's one, two. You get two in there, and it's a fair size. £1.50, you can't complain. That's 75p each. Let's just hope they taste good. So we've got to remove it from the film packaging. Or we've got to leave it on this cardboard on a microwavable plate. Like so. Come down, let's take a look. They smell nice. So let's open them up and see what's inside them. To be honest, that is absolutely pathetic. There's hardly anything in there. There's a tiny bit of cheese, some tomato puree. Wow. Where's the rest of it? I might ring them up and ask them where the rest is. Good fellas pizza pockets, more like bad fellas. So basically what we got here is a bit of pizza base. So my honest opinion on them is they're not too bad. They don't taste too bad. All they taste like is if you've got a pizza and scrape the toppings off because there's nothing inside them. The pizza base is nice and soft, but they are very dry. They are drier than my sense of humor and that's saying a lot. So will I be buying these again? Probably not. If you work on the road as a lorry driver or somewhere where you need a quick snack, these will be a nice tasty snack for you. And they're cheap as well, £1.50. Value for money wise, I'm gonna give these a six just because I was left disappointed with the lack of toppings inside. Can I actually call them toppings if they're inside? Lack of filling. Taste-wise, I'm going to give them a six as well. They weren't too bad. They weren't horrible. But they could have done with some more things inside them. Let me know if you've tried these yourself and what you think of them. If you did like this, then please like, comment, share, subscribe. If you didn't like this, it's just 10 minutes you've wasted of your life that you'll never get back again. And I'll see you in the next one.